installation guidelines for fabricated stainless steel gates. To begin, refer to your submittal drawing to make sure that the anchor studs are the correct size and are exposed to the proper length. Then use the double nut methods to hang the gate square and plumb. Using the front and back nuts, make sure the gate is perfectly plumb. Work from side to side and corner to corner, aligning the nuts with a straight edge. After you have the gate mounted, then inspect the cross rail seal. Start with the two middle nuts. Alternate between one and the other, working your way out to the edge of the gate as shown in the manual. Using a 4 thousandths feeler gauge, verify that it does not pass between the sealing surfaces. If you do have a place where it passes through between the seat and slide, you need to loosen the front nut and tighten up the back nut, bringing the frame of the gate closer to the slide and decreasing the potential for a leakage path. If possible, also follow a similar process to check the seals from the back of the gate. Make sure all your bolts are very tight and that you don't have any leakage paths across the seal. This is most critical part of your installation, making sure that the cross seal doesn't have any leaks. For more information on installing Waterman gates, refer to our installation manual and the other videos on our website.